A VPN is a technology that organizations, security experts, and hackers alike use to keep themselves safe online. In this video, I'll break down how a VPN works so you can learn the pros and the cons to keeping yourself safe online. And spoiler alert, Unlike what the VPN service providers are going to tell you, it's not going to keep you safe the way you might think it will. To create this secure tunnel, a user must install a VPN client on their computer and configure it to connect to a VPN server or device. Once configured, the user just simply types in their username and password and a secure tunnel is connected between the computer and the VPN device or server. This is going to keep all communication between the computer and the VPN server secure and encrypted. There are two types of configurations possible for a VPN service. First is called full tunnel. In a full tunnel configuration, all network traffic that leaves that computer is going to be sent through this VPN tunnel and go to that VPN server until it then goes on to its final destination. The second setup is known as split tunnel. In this configuration, only a subset of network traffic is going to go over that VPN tunnel. You'll often see organizations set it up this way so that only the traffic that's destined for their organization is going to go through that VPN tunnel. All other network destination traffic is going to go to its intended target. Let's look at a scenario to help us visualize this. In a full tunnel configuration, if I want to go to google.com, I'll type in google.com in my browser, and that traffic is going to leave my computer, go to that VPN server, and then it's going to go to google.com. In a split tunnel configuration, if my company sets this up so that only the traffic destined for my company goes through that VPN tunnel, if I go to access a file located on a file server in my company's network, that traffic is going to go over the VPN tunnel and I'll be able to access that file. If I wanna to go to google.com, that will simply go straight to Google servers and be processed there. This is important to understand because the only traffic that is guaranteed to be encrypted is between your computer and that VPN server. This is why defenders love this, because when you set this up in a full tunnel mode, all of your network traffic is going to be encrypted up until that VPN server. So this is going to help avoid any eavesdropping by attackers or any parties that you wouldn't want to see your traffic. Another benefit here is that it hides your true source location. In the example that we gave with Google, Google is only going to see the connection originating from the VPN server. They're not going to see that you are behind that VPN device. This is why hackers love this because they can hide their true source destination and put all of their traffic behind that VPN device. So while a VPN is great at protecting your privacy and securing communication between you and that VPN server, it's not going to provide robust security to protect you against today's threats. For example, it's not going to prevent you from installing malware on your system or giving your username and password up to an attacker in a phishing attack. Another point to consider is that most network traffic today is already encrypted. You can just look in your web browser for the little lock icon to see when your web traffic is encrypted between your computer and that web server. So if you decide that you want to use a VPN service just to keep that additional information safe and secure, do it. But make sure that you're layering in additional security to keep yourself protected against today's threats.